What is going on? This is Altone, and today I have the pleasure of sharing with you a new upgrade to a, another drone from Holy Stone. This is the HS440G. So this is a really nice little drone, and I have it right here. Um, there are a few differences. Now I have the HS440, which I have here as well, which was the original, and then the 440D. And um, in each iteration, they've been actually upgrading this particular drone. Now, some of the differences between the 440 and even the 440D with this drone is it actually has brushed motors instead of brushless. So this guy will be able to handle uh, a, a little bit more wind uh, or have a little bit more wind resistance than the other two. And it does have a different style battery. Now the battery that it comes with, it comes with a single battery. That battery uh, should give you in calm conditions up to about 23 minutes of flight time, which I think is pretty good. They did upgrade the camera. They also upgraded the controller. This guy does have GPS, which is very similar to the 440D. Um, and again, better camera it's just a really nice little drone still less than 249 grams so you don't have to register it for a recreational flight here in the u.s shock mounted now 4k hd camera uh, it does have an sd card slot on it as well and that sd card slot of course any of your drones that have an sd card built uh, sd card slot built in they're going to provide you with better video and photo back uh, uh, from the drone than what you will get from the mobile device. Even though you don't have to use an SD card, the device will send the information back to your mobile device and save it as long as you give it permission to save to your photos on your mobile device. And then of course, one of the other things that they changed is they gave you a new remote and this remote actually has a display on it that will provide you with telemetry information. Now, what telemetry information actually means is that it will give you battery reading for the, the drone um, as well as it will provide you with some different information as far as distance and what mode the radio is actually set up. And of course, you have your GPS return to home, uh, GPS on and off button, your lock button, one key takeoff and landing. Then you have your photo video button at the top, a speed button on the other side, and then you have you have two scroll wheels. One of them controls your angle, the other one does not do anything. And of course your remote requires three AAA batteries that are not included. This guy flies very well. Very nice, very nice little drone. Now I will tell you one the only thing that I don't like it's the only thing i don't like about it and that is that it has a proprietary um charger for the battery so uh, i would love it if they put a usb-c connection on these but this charger still works fine but if you lose it you're going to have to purchase another charger for it and the good thing about that is Holy Stone usually has accessories available for their drones. So if you do happen to lose your, your your charger for your battery, you should be able to order another one. Not only that, but if you do order replacement or uh, extra batteries for this drone, it should also come with an additional charger as well. So you'll have backups regardless. So that I do think that's pretty good. Uh, outside of that, what also comes in a box is some of the standard things that come with many of the drones. They do send you additional props as well as the screws to mount those props and a screwdriver. So you don't even have to buy a screwdriver or find a screwdriver to replace your props. You'll have one. And then it comes with your manual, of course, and your quick start guide. The, and essentially, you can take the quick start guide and just use that very quickly to be able to get the drone in the air. But one of the things I would really pay very close attention to is in the manual, they give you some walkthrough instructions on how you're going to do the calibrations, how you're going to put the and, and get the drone in the air for the first flight, as well as flights after that. And I want you to pay very close attention to that because that should save you and actually save your drone if you do so, because many of the malfunctions that we as drone pilots see, 90, I wanna say 95% of the time, are based on the fact that we did not follow the instructions provided to us from the manufacturer. And that's very true for Holy Stone drones as well as any other manufacturer's drones. So, 
One of the other things that they actually did differently with this drone is you have a different case. This case is very familiar to me. It looks like a case from another brand's um, drones that I've seen in the past. It does have a nice little mesh pocket on both sides. You have your handle as well as you have a pocket in the front and that pocket is great for storing your manual which is usually where I keep mine because that makes it easier to get to instead of having to go into the case in this little mesh pocket for accessories in the top in order to grab a hold of your manual. So thank you so much for coming by and checking out this awesome drone with me. It's an absolute great drone for beginners. I believe they make some really really good quality products for beginners to get into the RC camera drone hobby. And so I do recommend this drone personally, but I also thank Holy Stone for sending it out to me so I get an opportunity to try it out. I really do appreciate that as well. Have an absolutely fantastic day and I look forward to seeing you again in future videos. Take care.